He said, there are some things I can't do. Making a fool of myself in goal, rattling my opponents and crossing the line, I just can't do that. I'm too rational and honest a man to go that way. I don't know how to win like that. Although I didn't really want to lose like that either. <laughs> what do you make of his comments, Frank? But that's the truth of the truth, you know? We know that uh, uh, Hugo is a very kind of shy person, does his job, very professional, but not as crazy as uh, Mr. Martinez showed, you know? And there is nothing to complain about what uh, did Emiliano Martinez on the field. I mean, he has the right to do that and to play that game. It's, uh, and Hugo expressed that. He didn't want to... He didn't want to say anything about what Martinez did after the game in the dressing room or partying with his friends about Mbappé and, and France and whatever. He said, uh, I don't want to say more because every, everything has been said about it. Um, uh, Hugo Lloris has been a model to every player, football players who want to be, you know, just do their job, not be committed and uh, involved in any, uh, any pr issues, any problems. Uh, he, he has a very good career. He's a very good person, very smart, and I think he has completely the right to say what he said. And uh, and 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 it's it's really the truth. Is that guy? Is that kind of guy? Is so respectful toward the others, and uh, and you, you can see this. It's, uh, it's 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 really who he is. Ale, what would you do to win like that? Oh, I would act like an idiot. I don't care. <laughs> if it meant winning or losing and the difference was me acting like an idiot, I would be out there doing whatever was necessary. Now, I respect the approach that Hugo Lloris takes. I, I respect what he's saying and what he's communicating. The only thing that I would say to him is, make a save. Make a save. Make a save, make a save, make a save. And if you do, then France is winning and you're lifting a trophy. It's much easier to say what Hugo Lloris has said when he's already had a World Cup. Right? When he's already won one. But if you haven't won one and it's dependent upon, and the difference, as you has just intimated and mentioned, that is acting like an idiot or not, there's no doubt as to what I would do. In fact, there's no limit as to what I would do if it meant that my country was going to win the World Cup. How far would you go, Luis? I think that we've seen every kind of situation and, and ways of, of behavior on the pitch. We've seen players scoring with a handball trying to do all kind of tricks, trying to get out of focus uh, to the people. I'm not saying as a keeper, but into, uh, as, a, as a football player inside the field, one of the players who, who play uh, the game. So if it means that uh, you're going to win, I understand that they are different character, different personality. I will, I've, I've been doing a few things, tricky things, trying to get out of uh, focus or try to get out of the game to try to win. And I remember once I was 18 and I was going to take a penalty. And I sent the keys to the keeper to try to get it out of focus. He saved the penalty, so I never done anything like that again. <laughs> so you learn and you keep going. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Luis. Well done. <laughs> All right. Thanks so much for watching ESPN on YouTube. And for more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for premium content and live streaming, subscribe to ESPN+.